Where to begin? Where to begin? So uh, my number five would be cyclists who don't realize that there's, they're a vehicle and want to play both sides. So they'll drive from the road into onto the sidewalk, back onto the road, they'll run red lights, they'll run stop signs, and endangering everybody, especially themselves, really bothers me. Number four would be the big one, distracted drivers. Oh my goodness, the amount of times that we have all seen drivers with their head down and they think nobody can see them, their heads bobbing up and down. We all know what you're doing and you're endangering everybody's lives. I'm going to borrow a line from Danny DeVito in Get Shorty. If you're important enough, they'll wait for you. That's really what it boils down to. So put the phone down, for goodness sake, when you're driving. My number three would be drivers on the highways who don't realize that the middle lane is not a parking lane. I want to make a bumper sticker that says, if you're getting passed on both sides on the highway, they might be speeding, but you're in the wrong lane. Because there are signs on the highway that say, slower traffic, keep right. That's what that means. It means you. If you're getting passed on the right, you're the slower traffic. Move over, for goodness sake. My number two biggest pet peeve with commuting would be tailgaters and it happened on my way here today as a matter of fact I don't understand why people seem to think that if you ride right up the bum of the vehicle in front of you it's going to make traffic move faster it's not going to do anything all it's going to do potentially is cause an accident and put me in a bad spot because you you can't wait I mean what's the what's the rush and my number one pet peeve of commuting in this city or anywhere for that matter is not using turn signals Oh my goodness, it's literally one finger to follow the rule of the road and let people know what you're about to do. And I understand people think, oh, I'm just making one quick lane change. Yeah, a quick lane change can wind you up in the hospital or me in the hospital. Just use the signal, that's what it's there for, and it's the law. Help me out. <laughs>